I mean, at this point, bro, if Bart ends up with the One Piece, I won't consider myself too surprised. That guy is busted. But guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Jack the Bus, and today we continue our Dress Rosa saga. And like I said, uh, Bartolomeo has one of the strongest Devil Fruits I have seen in One Piece thus far, and that's saying quite a bit, to be honest. It is a bit technical because it, it relies a lot on just defense and then repelling, but nonetheless, insanely strong, and him being able to just come completely absorb the king's punch and like seemingly effortlessly i think was a true display of that power but we're gonna hop into it today see what's new if you're new to the channel make sure you leave a subscription it is free and let's get started I wonder if Usopp's gonna, like, draw a comparison to where he spent the time skip, like I said. This feels exactly like that island. This feels a lot like that island. Like, this is his environment, man. There's some animals, too. Caesar, he is not here yet, little bro. We are a little bit early. What? Oh, sh Oh, my gosh! I thought that was freaking Fujitora's ship for a second. I thought it was gonna be him, like, there. Because they said they're gonna head to Green Bit. Oh, they cut the tree. Oh, wait, is that his ship? <gasps> oh, oh, this mast is broken. Did they land it here? What? There's consequences to your actions now, Caesar? Incredible. He's realizing, like, the danger that even Doflamingo's in, not having the Navy's protection. Usopp punching Caesar. Wait, Usopp hockey confirmed? Caesar, please, man! It's almost done! This is such a funny group. Robin, Usopp, Law, Caesar. They're actually gonna just go scout out the forest? I mean, they could be anywhere, bro. It's so dense. Usopp, why are you trembling, bro? This is just like your island. Like, so much like it. <laughs> Should've called his ass out, bro. Oh. What? Is that Navy? Oh my gosh, it is. Who led them here? Smoker alerted them, I'm guessing. Let them know they would be on green bit. Oh, it's the voice that drug the fish. Oh my gosh, I completely forgot about that already. This short-term memory loss is rough. That's the whole question of the show, unnamed individual. Oh, they're not gonna hand over the weapons. It sounds like children. Oh, that was a terrible move, little bro. Oh, uh, what is that? Wait, is it like a, what, what took Zoro stuff? Is it like a fairy? It is tiny. It kind of sounded like the thing that took Zoro's stuff, too. And they're yoinking everything. The fairies are real! They just declothed all of them. Villainous big humans. How many are there? They're so tiny. Oh, she's knocking them all out! She's grabbing them! Oh, shoot! Is it a fairy or is it just a really, really small person? Can I see? Oh, oh. It is a tiny little person. Huh. Okay. The port town. Oh, is this where Zoro is? Dude. Dude, if he's running one more time, bro. He's been running for like eight episodes! Oh my gosh. Oh, wait. Is the fairy with him? And like directing him on where to go? What? What? Get to the flower field. Hey, giving Zoro directions is worthless. I'm sorry. I guess it is fairies, but do they float or fly? Doesn't seem like it. I mean, they don't have wings or maybe some of them have wings. It's very well dressed, like color coded and everything. The hair and everything matches. Oh wait, is that a wing? Or is that a tail? No, oh, it does have little wings, I think. It's so tiny. Oh. Let it go, Zoro. So does nobody ever see them? Like, actually? A member of the scouting unit of the ton Tontada. Tribe of little people. Oh, It's crying. Maybe it's a fairy that's on Sunny, then. That's, like, messing with them. Or was, like, robbing them. The, you big humans. Oh. 
Did it break its leg? Aww. Zoro, help. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. The strength is like, oh my goodness gracious. My commander. Do I call them fairies? I... Oh, okay. I'll call them fairies. I want to see the leader of them. Reports of Don Quixote family? What? Oh, their whereabouts. Wait, what? So the commander. On their way to attack the straw head ship. Oh, shoot. No wonder he's in such a hurry. Bro, how many people or things or fairies or etc. on this island are actually like, plotting against the Don Quixote family? Like the toy soldier? This fairy? Like, bruh, Rebecca? Everybody! It's a goddamn revolution! Bro, the fairy's strength is like that of like an ant. Like how an ant can carry like a billion times its body weight. That's what it seems like. But like t t 20 fold. It just almost knocked down a building. Oh man, now they're gonna run for like 10 episodes and then we're gonna see the commander. <laughs> yeah, those goobers. So is that who's on the ship? Oh yeah, no, he doesn't stand a chance getting back. Zoro has run for so long that it would genuinely take him days to find it back, find the harbor again. Exhibit A, immediately. So he ended up just taking the fairy's help. Now it makes sense now. It's actually incredible. Absolutely incredible. I'm back to the Coliseum. At least we have a semi-resolution with that. Well, another strand to follow, but still. There's the dawn. Oh, that's right. They're still repairing the arena. Bro, Chin Chao really does not like Luffy. His beard has a mind of its own. So whenever he's enraged, his beard goes up. Oh, there he is. Just chilling up there. Good spot, Luffy, actually. Oh, okay. And we're gone. That was an interesting use of time. What? Everything that's been in your mind since we first met? She's like, she, she can like see your thoughts? Is that why her eyes changed? Shutting gun! And so she works for them? Bro, this is so sad. Uh, she's still bad, though. <laughs> so, what... What was the purpose of this? An assassin of the Don Quixote family? Oh my gosh, bro. I mean, out of anybody to fall for, it was one million percent Sanji. All girls are the same, man. Was she just acting, or was some of it real? Aw, poor Sanji. He was gaslit too. Because his love for you is strong. Oh my gosh. Heel to the face, man. Can she actually see his thoughts? Lies. Then she, she, she would know he was not lying. If she can actually see his thoughts. The glare glare fruit. Quite, wait, glare glare? Can see through anything? What? Yeah, let's see what's in Sanji's. Wait, what? She can see all of that? Because it comes to his mind. She's going to see that he actually just loves her. Wait, that's a crazy fruit, though. Is there a pose for this devil fruit? Ain't no way she does this. Be being mind. <laughs> She's gonna see all the women. <laughs> yep, no, that's about how it goes. Yep. His whole mind is as pink colored as his. He just loves women. Actually. Dude, this is the soundtrack. Oh, does she feel any guilt, actually? Oh, I feel really bad for Sanji, bro. She's got to get some remorse for him for seeing that. He didn't have, like, an ulterior motive or anything. She's actually crying. Hey, listen, call me naive, but maybe this relationship is salvageable. 641. I still can't go over this guy. It's just a house. I, I, no explanation needed, actually. 
I guess it's like a, a toy technically. She's not gonna let him kill him. I feel like Sanji should be worth more than 77 mil. I'm gonna be honest. What? There's a part two to her power? She's defending him! I wail? It's like hurt the power of her tears? Oh my gosh! What the f is that? She's defending him. Oh shoot. The relationship is salvageable, baby. We're saved. She saw his true intentions. Oh my gosh. Wait, that was so easy. Against her will? Wait, really? Oh, now their love can prosper even more. He can save her. Aww. Bro, this flipped on a dime so hard. I feel bad. I, I called her a bitch. Oh, run away together. Oh, oh, oh. I figured Doflamingo wanted them to arrive. Can she show her thoughts? Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. He'll be able to see everything. It's dress for us this morning. Oh, shoot. This could be juicy. CP0, Doflamingo. Let me see more! Sanji gets all the juice? All the lore? Really? Oh my god, bruh. So we got Burgess. Burgess. We got Bart. And now C. He's stretching. I mean, Luffy's gonna actually have to, like, really defend himself, man. Dude, it's literally just an animal. How did the bull even enter? How did It doesn't have opposable thumbs. How did it write on the form? The dawn. Dawn Chinjao. It's starting! Block C, baby! I, like I said, our boy's making it. I already know. I, I have absolute, complete faith in our captain. But, like, unironically, I don't think anyone here poses a threat against Luffy. I mean, he one-shot Don Chin Zhao outside of the arena. He'll do it inside the arena. What's happening? Oh, the soldier, the toy soldier. Filled with happiness. Always be by your side. What? Is this like his backstory? Is that Rebecca? Oh yeah, she's just vibing. Wait, does she know the toy soldier? What the hell is happening, man? A flower. She does know the toy soldier, I think. I mean, if he's working against Doflamingo and she is, it's not that crazy. Oh, for some reason her saying monkey saw, I thought like Luffy. I was like, what's happening? Frankie! Flower field. Wait, well, she knows who he is. She would call to him or something. Say something. There you go. Oh, he does know her. <laughs> Rebecca. Oh my gosh. What is happening? That's why he was looking at the list. Oh. Alright, so they're comrades. Can we live together? What? <laughs> I love this little toy soldier so much. Uh. Interesting. Uh, he obviously cares about her. He told her not to enter. Didn't want her to get hurt or anything, I'm guessing. He wants to protect her? Maybe she wants to try to protect him. Oh, they care about each other. Oh, Bro! I care so much about these two. And we just met them. Interesting. No idea what's going on, but interesting. She's just holding him still? <laughs> She's like interrogating him. Oh, maybe this is where the little one with Zoro is trying to get. Usopp. <laughs> I mean, obviously they're not harming him, though. She's just gently holding him. Oh my gosh. They're gonna shoot her. Hey! Don't lay a finger on Robin! No! Oh, oh, that, that was... Oh, they're gonna knock him out. Bro! Why did we wander into this forest so deep, man? For what reason? Are they gonna harvest them? <laughs> they have to die. Oh my gosh. I mean, obviously they're protective for a reason. Like, uh, either they don't trust humans for a reason or what, but obviously some are trying to, like, uh, fight back against the Don Quixote family, so maybe that's why. Like, they have a bad experience with them, most likely. Oh, that's a needle. They're threading the needle. They're robbing her. One of the the leaders here. She's gonna wake up. Oh! Where is that? Ah! 
Bro! Bro! Oh my gosh! Oh my goodness! Bro! They just straight crawling around everything! Oh hell nah! You leave her alone! Oh, they sewed her hair into the grass! Oh hell nah! You take your hands off my queen! Stitch, stitch power. Oh, so they're gonna have devil fruits. No, we're nice! A tiny devil fruit eater. Leo. Tontata. Yeah, that's where the other one's from. The tribe. Oh, look at all. They're so, they have a little village. Aw. This is so cute. Imagine they're like, yeah, we ate him. Yep, we consumed him. Tontata kingdom. Oh, this is adorable. Underneath the great forest that they created? No plant we can't grow. I feel like Usopp would be able to power spike here. Yeah, but I, I think she can like... Yeah, it'll create a storm. I think she can reason with them. I think they're just very... Uh, the, the, the defenses are just very high. No! She comes in peace. Yeah, they, they maintain secrecy. I mean, even in, in Dressrosa, it was a complete rumor that fairies existed. And they were right, kind of. <laughs> That's all it takes? What? Is this a joke? Why are they so trusting? Uh, yeah. I don't know what that word means, but yeah. Why are they credulous? Oh, they're so sweet. The chief. Oh, shoot. Isn't this where the one with Zoro is trying to get to? Okay. <laughs> Where's Usopp? I don't have a chance to stare. Can't you just go to dress Rosa and stare? Goncho. The chief. The king of Tontata. Goncho. How nice! Wait, they're all so sweet! Tree sap cookies are delicious. Oh, look at their furnishing and everything. This is so cute. It's probably like a dream come true for Robin, too. There's like this whole kingdom that she discovered. Ah, uh, he retired him from being a transponder snail. Wait, once you do that, once you take off, like, they, they can't be used anymore, right? She's got to go. Give us your weapon. She doesn't have one. It's just her hands. Her beautiful hands. Oh, no. Guys, chill. Back on my queen. And just run, Robin. Oh, my God, they're fast. Bro. How is she supposed to give up her weapon? Why did I think that was Chopper for a second? <laughs> the hero's partner? Who's the hero? Usopp is the hero? Why is Usopp a hero? What? The legendary? They have a legend about Usopp! And then they just switch up. The uh, I can't, bro. What did he tell them? <laughs> he should have lied to all of these people. Wait, what is this? A point of time for the handover. Is this Dress Rosa? Oh, it's beautiful. It's like a town square. Two minutes. <gasps> Ooh. He's trying to call them. Oh. Oh. It's a setup. It's a setup. Oh, shit. Oh, shoot. Oh, man. Dude, I wish we had gotten to see what Violet showed him, though. I mean, it might have, like, spoiled a little bit too much, and then we wouldn't have gotten this moment. But I think it uh, is all a setup. But is it so, like, crazy for me to think that Law wouldn't be naive and would think that Doflamingo would try to pull something? I mean, it's Doflamingo, bro. Someone that I don't think would ever just, like, I guess, barter, or, or like, especially, like, using Caesar as a hostage. But if things are here, Getting up in Dressrosa, man. And if Law is to have to leave, he's kind of trapped on this island. Whether or not he wants to try to book it all the way across the bridge, I don't think he would. Like, how else is he supposed to get, especially across the gap? But he might just have to run into the forest and hide. Because there's no telling how many people Doflamingo might bring if he is planning to just straight up attack. But I feel like Law should have just assumed this if that is the case. Doflamingo's a sneaky guy. A, a, a sort of one that you wouldn't shouldn't trust ever. 
But is it, it is interesting the development of Violet turning because if she is like a higher rank, like an assassin in the Don Quixote family, it's good to have her on their side. And it was just because Sanji was just very genuine with her, something she never expected. And soon begins the Block C battle where again, I, I think Luffy's just gonna take it. It's just about how long everybody else lasts. But guys, that has been it for my reaction today. I hope you did enjoy. Dressrosa is getting crazy. If you're new to the channel, make sure you leave a sub and I'll see you guys next time. Peace, peace.